How long you been here at uh, Breathe Vape Spot? Actually, I kind of just started, so this is like my third week. Third week, and how do you like it? I love it. I was always just like building coils at home, so might as well do it here. And what do you like better about dripping over over the egos on this? <laughs> I love the strong throat hit. It's more comparable to a cigarette. Even better, actually, a lot, a lot harder. Yeah. How about the flavor and? Food? It's way more flavor, especially with cotton. What's uh, what's the top selling flavors uh, by Cyber? Apple Jacks and my favorite Crunch Berries. Nice, nice. Are you guys uh, planning on picking up the new flavor, Vader? Vader? I hope so, because I love that one too. Awesome, awesome. What type of mods do you guys have in the store? Oh, uh, we got all kinds of mods. We got some Kings, Chiyu's, Nemesis, Stingray, and probably the most popular was the Manhattan. Right That's what I got right here. <laughs> um, you guys, I, are you, do you have any in stock right now? No, not anymore. They sold out. Wow, are you probably going to order in? Hopefully, I yeah. think so. Very cool, yeah. So, um, if I were to come in here, new to vaping, what would you recommend um, as a setup to start out? I would recommend the Ego Twist. It's got variable voltage from 3.3 to 4.8. And you can have a, a bottom coil clearizer, which gives a lot of flavor because it, you're waking from the bottom. And that would be really good for starters who just want to quit cigarettes. But for the people that want clouds, that's where the mod comes in. And why why is it better to have the coils at the bottom? Is it just, uh, it feeds in better? Mm -hmm. And why would you suggest this as a startup? Is it just because it's it's a little bit more simple to use? Yeah, it's simple and it's super easy. All you have to do is set the voltage to your preference. And easy to fill? Yeah, yeah, super easy. Okay, very cool. Now what if I'm like, kind of, I've got this set up, but I want to get a little bit more clouds, uh, a little more vapor production, I'm looking for a little bit better flavor. Where would you suggest I, I start out with or, or move up to? I would move up to a mod and here we have a brass stingray and these have copper and silver plated contacts. So it's pretty conductive for clouds. So that's better for the conductivity, mm -hmm. right? And we got a Patriot clone on this. A three post for dual coils. We would drill out the holes for more air and more clouds. And what's the price? What price point am I looking at for an Ego setup versus a uh, clone setup or a K100? For an Ego setup, you're looking at around 50 with the charger, and for a mod setup, you're looking at around 150 with the charger and a battery. Okay, so it's a little more expensive, but you're going to get a little bit better experience. Um, yeah or a lot better experience mm -hmm. depending on, on what you're looking Definitely get for. more clouds with the mod. Yeah, I got the uh, Manhattan. Um, I'm actually, I just picked this up about a week ago. Nice, I definitely want the pink one. Yeah, they just came out with the new yeah, pink Manhattan. Yeah, I love Manhattan. it. Manhattan. Conductivity on this is great. It's got a magnetic button. It's got like virtually no voltage drop on it. Yeah, 0 .009 yeah. voltage drop, so you're gonna get a constant uh, strong vape from the beginning of the charge on your battery all the way all the way to the end so um, just a really solid mod and at the price point they're uh, retailing at about uh, 169 to 180 in stores so pretty solid you guys have them here too yeah we did before they flew off <laughs> <laughs>